Zombies nuts. Oh, oh. Got him. that was good. Thanks, Mike. Thanks, Mike. Snake. Snakes. Snake. Snake. What happened? Come in. Snake. 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 <laughs> The fucking moon base alpha video. <laughs> <laughs> ew, ew. Ew, ew. John nine, Men. Nine, nine, John nine, Men. Nine, nine, nine. <laughs> nine, nine, Football. Nine. <laughs> holla, holla, get dollar. <laughs> John Madden. John Madden. John Madden. I'm laughing for real right now. <laughs> <laughs> nine, nine, nine. Nine, Check nine. Check out this FMV. <laughs> Here we go. Holy shit, them graphics! Also, I can't believe you did grab Question the mark, exclamation point, question mark, no exclamation exactly. point, question mark, mark exclamation, exclamation, exclamation point. point. <laughs> and also, so Carrie's funny. here. She hasn't said anything, but she's here. I think I laughed at something. Oh, she's okay. eating water. She's I'm actually not eating, eating anything right now, but I can. Eat some water. Eat some water. I'm I'm waiting for my electrolytes to dissolve in the water. What do you use, Mio? Do it. Like that. I don't. You know, I make my own. I put in magnesium chloride, sodium chloride, except for I use kind of a sea salt. It's probably a mix of a bunch of different minerals, and then um, potassium chloride. Sodium chloride is table salt. Yeah, but but I use sea salt, and so it's probably. I mean, it has a combination of various trace minerals as well, so, so it's not strictly sodium chloride. Super powered seawater is on here. Yeah, and then I add extra magnesium and a little extra potassium. Magnesium extra powder magnesium is how you make bromine. Bro, why are you so mean? Flashbangs. Okay, you said flashbangs with magnesium powder? I wonder what oh, these are. I said magnesium powder when struck it can be turned into flash powder, which is then condensed and put inside flashbangs. So, yeah. Yeah. Ma but, but what type of magnesium, though? It has to be, has to be, has to be bound to something. Um. Uh, um uh, it's the one, uh, I would just say powder form, but there's like three different kinds of powder. Oh, yeah. He tried to throw up on me. Did you see that? I did. That was foul. Who thinks he's mm -hmm. a fucking boomer from Left 4 Dead? Get out of here. <laughs> Will you take the vodka? You know, that is best. Oh, wait, it says there's a magnesium flax powder. I want a magnesium. You see, you or, see. Maybe it is not magnesium. Gabe, specifying the specific name of the creature from Left 4 Dead implies playing Left 4 Dead without mods on. Well, I mean, even if it's fucking Tinky Winky running at me and throwing up at me and blowing up, I still know it's a boomer. Listen, all I'm go all I'm going to say is if you're not replacing the model for the tank with Donkey Kong, you have failed already. <laughs> You're right, because instead... <laughs> Instructables has, has how to make flash powder in three steps. I think I've followed that, actually, that 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 process for a science project I did senior year. I'm pretty sure I did, because I made flash oh, paper. Oh, that's really interesting. You know what would know be cool? You know what would be cool? A commentary uh, where Gabe and Carrie co opt Left 4 Dead. <laughs> oh! <laughs> That'd be pog. What level do you usually play on? In one or two. Um, two? Okay, okay, okay. In two, if if I'm giving you my joke answer, it's hard rain. Because I love not being able to see anything or hear anything. I think it's funny. But if I'm being serious, then the mall. I'm not for that. Just because it's... I mean, it's just the fucking... I'm mean, sorry, that was really... That was terrible. Excuse you, sir. But, uh... <laughs> Like, I mean, it's just, I mean, like, yeah, you could argue, you know, like, oh, you know, give that Oh, guy I love this, I love this. The fucking startup screen for the Umbrella computer. Oh my gosh. I love her fake hands. Watch her <laughs> typing. I love how everything is Umbrella brand. 
So I just, I'm sorry. So I, I got to say one of those, like, I, I love the aesthetic of old tech. And, oh, yeah. um, I, 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 like a lot of that has to do with startup screens too. And just like the sounds that they make, they're just so, I just find them so charming for Windows some reason. Windows 98 is fucking gas. Um, I am personally, my favorite is Windows 95. 95 is good. Windows XP, baby. XP is where it's, it's at. the earliest I know. We didn't, I don't think I, oh no, I've done Windows 95. Speak. Um, yeah, the thing like, so Windows, like Windows 95 is probably my favorite and it has, it was already my favorite before that fucking meme where it's like, change the world. My final message. Final goodbye. Message. Boom. 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 Fortunate turn of events. I just I was written, written I, I by do famed electronic musician Brian Eno. I do really like that meme though, just because um just because uh I don't know, it feels weirdly nostalgic to a game I never played. <laughs> mm -hmm. You know? Do you, do you get yeah. that feeling? <laughs> yeah. 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 Something that's developed those feelings. There's, there's, I think there's Ada, certain ways by to the do time that. you read this, I'll be something different. Today's test it's, turned out to be positive. Not, Just as expected, I have COVID. Because <laughs> Brian Eno actually spent a lot of time working on that jingle. And he had like a whole bunch of drafts. And they told him it could only be like six seconds long. And so he's, he just had to come up with all these configurations. And that was the one he ended up with. And then when he went back to making songs that were like normal length, he said it felt like he had oceans of time. If everything is in order, all the locks can be opened be by the security yeah. system. You can access the security system if you log in with my name from the terminal in the small lab and enter the password. The password is your name. To unlock the door at B2 where the visual data room is located, you'll need to access with our names first and then enter another password. I've written the code below. I'm sure you'll understand it easily. And this is my last hope. If you find me completely changed, please kill me yourself. But please, I beg you, do not go around cucking the biggest dork ever. <laughs> Yours, <What>? John. <laughs> Password. Marm. <laughs> I translated it. Thank you. You're welcome. Should Little did we know, know that Ada unfortunately <laughs> would go and cuck the biggest dork ever. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Ada Wong. Stupid bitch. She did. Her. She did, Ada Wong. I hate that. But I cannot deny that she's a killer in a dress. Bang, bang. Yeah, quite literally. She does kill people in she that dress. She does kill people in that dress. <laughs> also, she's fairly attractive while wearing the dress. I just tapped my water bottle fairly and then she's fucking shaking and waking. Stop! Damn. Stop! Thank you. This is me when I watch. Hey, Apple, game. man, woman, really? I feel like you have to explain that is your a, art. That is an amazing, amazing depiction of Eden's garden. You know what? As a matter of fact, I think when I go, you know, to a famous art museum, I think I'm just gonna <laughs> literally just like label everything on the painting. Well, you know, like, I think when... Lisa, I'm just writing "girl" over it. Yeah, That's I think I love this. That's how they give you the code. How did they get the code? Yeah. Well, I think, I think that when I go to a famous art museum, I'm going to get trapped inside and all the people disappear, and then they, uh, and then the paintings come to life and try to kill me. Oh, <laughs> dude, nice. That's a fucking cave story reference. Yeah! Nice. Gotta love RPG Maker games. <laughs> okay, so I just want to share this because apparently Sega... Uh, probably Sega of America, but I'm not sure who specifically. They had a Green Hill themed mini golf course in their office. <laughs> oh yeah, I saw I saw pictures of that. I was like, damn. Yeah, no, actually it is because it's uh, it, it that the post is actually from Sega of America. So yeah, yeah. yeah. I was like that's crazy. It's like fun. Imagine you just get up and you're like, you know what? I've done my, you know, let's say you do uh, data analytics, and you're like, yep. Looks like people are still mad about Sonic Frontiers. I've done my job today. Go hit a couple balls with my boys up in uh, research and development. Sonic Golf Course. 
So, yeah, I, I want to say after we found out that the IGN footage will actually was from an earlier build and seeing more stuff, I got to say, honestly, I've gone from being disappointed back to having no expectations at all. Yep. Uh, so, you know, Imagine, if like, Bill, I have always had no expectations. Uh, that's good. That's smart. I am not a Sonic guy. Yeah. This guy is not a Sonic guy. He can only run so fast. My, I was my, just about to say that. My main concern, <laughs> my main concern with the game is that uh, since it's designed uh, like where it has like the open zone segments, as they insist on calling them, yeah. uh, but also like regular stages sprinkled in, I'm a little concerned. Like the the what what is in the open zone sections will make or break the game because no matter how good. No matter how good the regular stages are, if the open zone sections feel like padding, I'm not going to have fun. Yep. That's one of my biggest issues with Sonic Unleashed, actually. So. All right. Basement door lock operation. Select four. Password. John Madden. You know, John actually, yeah. super, uh, super, super cool thing. You know, I will give 2K Games some credit here. Uh, as we know, John Madden, Mr. The Voice of Football himself, uh, passed away last year. Yeah. And uh, a very nice gesture. Uh, this year, Madden uh, made him the cover star again. Uh, 2K Games doesn't make Madden. EA does. EA, you're right, my bad. Go Madden. Challenge everybody. You see, uh, actually, that's a pretty... That's actually... There's a story behind that, actually, okay? Mm. So, um... Let me let me let me let me fun. let me get this up actually because I want to actually like read this out to make sure I have all the information correct. Mm -hmm. Um. See what Jill's doing on the computer and I'll tell you what Evan's doing too. All right, Let's all right, right, all right, all right. So this comes straight from this comes straight from TV traps. I'd like to point out, but basically it says. Um, so, yeah, visual concepts before like when Sega still owned the 2K series, basically. Mm -hmm. Or I think I think this is after afterward. This is after Sega sold them, so never mind. But visual concepts, ESPN NFL 2K5 was acclaimed by many critics as a better American football game than EA's Madden 05, and to this day is still recognized as one of the best ever ga made games in the genre. Oh, I know it was when Sega still owned them. Okay, but Sega released the title three weeks before Madden and sold it for only $19.99 as opposed to $49.99 that was customary for AAA video games at the time. So basically, basically, uh, not only did Sega make the better game, they also uh, released it like right before Madden and priced it way lower. Oh my gosh. That's a power move right there. Well <laughs> but, but... EA was so furious about this uh, that they signed a deal with NFL that granted them the exclusive rights to use the NFL license until 2010, which they have redeemed three times now, uh, the most recent one being in 2020, which is why Madden is the only football game anymore. Oh my gosh. Wow. That's a lot of drama. On the flip side, the inverse happened with uh, MLB. Probably MLB, in response uh, yeah. to the NFL thing. And also uh, NBA as well. Really? The 2K. Yeah, I do know about that. Again, uh, EA was... Because EA was making NBA Live, yeah. which was a competitor to the 2K series. But Sega doesn't own the 2K series anymore. They they sold it off. So Yeah, I know. But even then, when was the last NBA Live game you heard coming out? To be fair, to be fair, I... um. Actually, 20, 20, I don't really follow. I don't really follow sports games, so I couldn't answer that. Uh, but what I can tell you is that apparently, like, apparently, based on the word of mouth that I've heard from other people, NBA Street is better. <laughs> oh, in luck, dog! So many right. acronyms. I'm going to die. National Basketball Association Street is a very, very good game because it takes good basketball techniques and handling and aside from making it buttery smooth also adds in street ball elements so you so there's like oh and and the customization that customization that came is fucking wild bro you can like make your own jumper and this is like kind of groundbreaking stuff because like didn't one of them also could, have mario in it yes 
I forgot which one, but yes, you can make um because nowadays it's commonplace where you can like, you know, make your own jump shot, make your own dunk, make your own layup, yada yada. But like back then, it was like you were given player packages, um, which is like, oh, you can you know, shoot like Tim Duncan, and then you know, have. I just want to say Tim Duncan Iverson is crossover. the best name for a basketball player ever. And Tim Duncan was an amazing basketball player. He Please tell me that fun. wasn't. Please tell me that wasn't just like a stage name. No, that was his actual name, TD. Tim Duncan. Okay, okay, seriously, that is just the best name for a basketball player ever. And his nickname was the Big Fundamental because he did everything fundamentally so well that nobody could stop him. Wow, amazing! He was literally so good at doing everything how you're supposed to do it that no one could beat him. It's perfect. He was Played too good. Spurs. He w- he was too good because he just wasn't bad. There you go. Um. <laughs> But yeah, so you could like shoot like TD and then, you know, maybe have like some Steve Nass passes and, uh, you know, a Michael Jordan dunk or whatever. But those weren't like custom. Those were like you were given packages and assigned certain, you know, moves to or certain moves to certain things with certain player packages. But now you can like, you know, do customize pretty much everything. But like being able to do that in NBA Street, that was like a big fucking deal because no one had been able to be like, oh, I can... I can make my own crossover. I can fucking make my own no-look bounce pass. It's crazy. Yeah, man. That's why this game is popular. But also because it was just fucking fun and good. And the music selection, too? Oh, my God. Oh! It was good. Carrie, what's your opinion on basketball? I know you used to play. Um, Basketball. That's the one where you pick the ball into the goal, right? Mm-hmm. So what's your opinion on it? Um... It's a ball. Hang on a second. And... I actually completely forgot that Carrie used to play basketball, actually. I played it for I'll one year forget. in third grade, and I was so short, the coach didn't play me unless he had to. You know, I'll never forget. I, I think it's worth noting that you mentioned that, because that is the exact same experience that I had with basketball, like right down to the year that I was in third grade. In my, in my head, oh my Kevin, gosh. Carrie will always be a star point guard. <laughs> Directing That's the whole funny. game on court and stuff. No, I'm a center. You are not. Look, jokes can only go so far. You will not play a center. <laughs> yeah, Kerry's more of an outfielder, if you ask me. Oh, hell yeah. Soccer terms. Wait, soccer. That's the one with the racket, right? Yeah. Yeah. And you hit the shuttlecock over the net and stuff. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Exactly, oh, wow. boxing. That's what it's called. Am I being gaslighted? <laughs> I believe the correct term is gaslit. Gaslit. Oh, you're doing it again. <laughs> Fun fact, did, did you know that gaslight is the name of the font used in Sonic 2? Did you know that, that gaslight you're gaslighting me. is when <laughs> there's the a font? gas leak? Yeah, the font. The, the shitty text font, in my opinion. He's a liar. It's, or unless it's true. I don't know. It could be. I don't know. I don't no, care. No, actually, actually, never the, even font, heard of the font the font used for the text in Sonic 2 is called Gaslight. That's really funny. Kill that guy. Well, then no, when did the movie come out that popularized the term gaslighting? 1947. Really? What you liar? <laughs> Google it right now. Oh, you were guys, really like, close, actually. It was 1944. Or maybe, really maybe he knew that and he was just trying to gaslight you. That's just called lying. Gaslight, gaslighting would be if I, I already really, knew it. I really I did know it. that, though. I just I didn't know the exact year, but... This yeah, is the really, worst really commentary close. ever. <laughs> oh, I get it. He's trying to... I don't know. We're just emulating... We're just emulating wider society by our... Occurred is typoed. Occurred is typoed. Occurred is typoed. The T virus. The T pose virus. Although it is very difficult to obtain... Oh, shit. It is thought that more than half of the researchers died after exposure to the T-virus. The body count will most likely increase since nearly all the survivors show symptoms peculiar to the T-virus. Second, our security system is still in operation. However, our special security fuck, because of that, research information (laughs) considered by our company to be top secret has been made available to outsiders. Counter 
future measures should be taken as soon as possible. Finally, many of the subjects from the experiment have escaped and are out of control. We believe that some researchers were killed by these subjects and their bodies were mutilated. By curious coincidence, these events are proof of the success of our research. However, there is also a very high risk that this news may be leaked to the press if we don't act immediately. The condition is very serious. Our operation to cover up the situation is difficult to attain. However, we hope the problem will be solved quickly. We are especially concerned that the state police and STARS are intervening too quickly. We need to act on this situation as well. Umbrella. Facts has been filed. Those were facts. That was oh, a fact. Oh, shit. Site 1998. All facts, no printer. 1998. Whoa, boobs. <laughs> oh. A wooga, a wooga. Punch yourself in the face with comically large boxing glove 20 times. Eyes pop out of skull. Heart beating out of chest in the shape of a heart. Uh, pants. Ruff, ruff, ruff. Ruff, ruff. Bark, bark, bark. A wooga, a wooga. Uh, pants. Uh, jaw drops to the floor. Tongue rolls out like red carpet. Rolls back up like fruit by the foot and come, uh, closes jaw. Eyes. Um, a steam whistle sound blows as steam blows out of the side of my ears. And to top it all off, is this is slam poetry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And to top it all off, to top it all off, to top it all off, has an erection. Has has uh has has erection. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be perfectly honest. That was like some bars. <laughs> Thanks, man. I uh, I, uh life. I thoroughly enjoyed slam poetry because I'm known to talk out of my ass at varying speeds and degrees. Oh, you would be really good at slam to draw attention. If you want, if you want, if. I'm going to post an accurate, an accurate image. Accurate. Yeah, a, accurate. Yeah, an accurate, an it's accurate image to express uh, exactly what I am talking about in the Discord. Here we go. Don't Here we post go. a picture of an erection. <laughs> he did. He. <laughs> there you boner? have it, folks. Oh, Pog! He did his boner. <laughs> Donald Dick. Have there he is. <laughs> uh, and you, you see, just because Gabe said that, he, like, I think anybody watching this probably knows exactly what the image is, too. <laughs> I would not yeah. have. So I, I should thank you for, for showing me. Terry, that's because you don't know what a meme is. <laughs> it's as simple as that, Karen. I thought you were going to say because you don't know what a dick is. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, nice job. <laughs> to be uh, fair, I know. I, I nice only just job. learned that males existed yesterday. Doctors assistant. What did you think I was last week? <laughs> a worm. A worm? Oh. I am a worm and no man, says the Psalms. Huh? I just quoted the Bible. Well, I can quote Carrie. Well, I didn't choose not, the well, worm people life. People are not into BDSM like I am. I, I didn't choose the worm life. <laughs> Next time on Smash Team Games, we study dicks. Oh, I'm, I, I, no. 